Welcome back to Coffee Holly. It's the fall season and we're here with a recipe we're sure you're going to love. This is a caramel apple oat milk iced latte. Here's what you're gonna need. Any milk or milk alternative of your choice. Here I'm using oat milk. Since we're making a latte, we're going to need 3 4 cups or six ounces of the oat milk. Monin caramel apple butter syrup, or I made some homemade brown sugar syrup, but you can use Tarani's cinnamon brown sugar syrup. Two Nespresso single shot espresso capsules. This is blonde roast from Starbucks. A pitcher to froth your milk. An electric hand whisk. A suitable vessel, small cocktail shaker, or mason jar for shaking the espresso caramel sauce and apple pie spice a smaller vessel or espresso glass to capture the extracted espresso and of course an espresso virtual machine pour your chilled milk into the pitcher i'm now going to follow that with monin caramel apple butter syrup i'm pouring about two tablespoons of this syrup into my milk the next ingredient is optional but i'm going to use one tablespoon of this homemade brown sugar syrup and add it to my milk i'm also going to add a small amount of this apple pie spice to the milk mixture. Now that the mixture is prepared, we're going to move on to the espresso. Let's turn this machine on and get brewing. Your Nespresso machine knows which capsule you're brewing because of the barcode that's around the outer edge. And this particular capsule is a single shot of espresso. Let's enclose the capsule and start the machine by pressing the brew button. To help move things along, I'm going to use time lapse and speed up this portion of the video. We're going to repeat the last step and brew the second capsule. We're going to start by adding inclusions to the bottom of the cup. I'm going to add caramel syrup and you can use any amount that you'd like. I'm also adding about a teaspoon of this caramel apple syrup to the bottom of the cup. To my mason jar I'm adding a little bit of ice before I add the espresso. I sealed my jar and now I'm going to give it a few shakes. Now it's time to add ice to the cup where I have the caramel and the caramel apple butter syrup. I'm now going to froth the milk mixture that I made earlier. The time you've all been waiting for. Let's add everything to the cup. We're going to start with the milk mixture that we frothed. Gently pour in that double shot of espresso that you brewed earlier and I also made a small amount of the caramel with the caramel apple butter syrup mixture to make a drizzle. So I'm going to add it to the top of the cup and drizzle it over the foam. The last thing I'm going to do is dust a little bit of the apple pie spice on top of the caramel drizzle. If you love apples and especially apple crisp you're going to to enjoy this drink. If you recreate this drink or make a version of your own, please let us know what you think in the comments below. If you'd like to see more coffee videos, please be sure to subscribe to our channel. Until next time, Coffee Holly fans.